Hey Glam Fam, Linwood here with my grandma, Melina. <laughs> hey everybody. So today we're doing a surprise wig review, which Sam's Beauty <laughs> has reached out. It was like, would you like to review a wig? And I was like, sure, let's go ahead and do something different. We can go ahead and switch up our channel, switch up her channel, make some things happen, and be super petty in the midst of it. But Melina has no idea what I've ordered. No, and I texted him earlier. Actually, I've texted you several times and asked you what this wig looks like. He actually got it in the mail today. Today. And I was like, send me a pic. I want to see what it is, what we're doing. <laughs> and he sent me a picture of an envelope. I was like, I just asked him, like, what does this wig look like? Is it ugly? Like, what's going on? And he gave me the look, like... I mean, if it's ugly, it'll match her personality, so... I fine. can't stand you. <laughs> <laughs> I hate you so much. So here's the box. Are you I'm, ready? I'm scared. Have you already seen it? I only saw it online. And that's yeah, the I could, Oh, ever. God. I, okay. Okay. I mean... <laughs> laughing like this even makes me more nervous because I know I am such a good yeah. friend how dare you okay I'm like trying to peek in there like I told him I'm gonna throw it like throw it out the window if it's just absolutely horrendous <laughs> okay so that's not bad what color is that it's like a dark blue and black so it's the what is it invisible deep part wig by studio cut um, this is from samsbeauty.com. I'll put all the links down below. It's called the Angled Wave. The color is OTD BLBK. That's a lot to remember for a color. Can I just say, like, the name of the color? Well, I'm thinking, what well, what's it say? Um, I don't know what OTD stands for. However, comma, BLBK means blue black. Okay. So, so I'm not scared of that because I've had this color, like, as my base before. So that color is not nothing... I figured we'd Scary. start safe and work our way to more Don't ridiculous. Don't you do anything orange or yellow. Or yellow can be crude. Not on me. I already am yellow enough. It's okay if you look like a mustard bottle. It it's makes totally me look fine. sick when I wear yellow. I cannot. I love yellow, but I can't wear it on. So I like the cut. The style of it's sort of cute. Okay, so while she's looking at that, it has a hand-tied curved part. Um, it says it's heat resistant and curling iron safe up to 360 degrees, which is actually kind of low. Like a lot of wigs are usually like 400 these days, but 360 I think it's fair. I don't know how I feel about the front of it. I thought it was going to be like a standard lace wig. And no, it it's, like not, it's not. It's not a lace wig. It's just got a little strip of something. Is that what they're calling it? It has like a, a part line strip in there. But, uh, okay, so let me give you the pointers on how to show a wig. <laughs> Ooh, ah, so you guys can see the color and then on the inside we've got combs to either side of the part oh, where is it? there we go we got combs to either side of the part right here um it's got like a uh like feel it's like a felt material here yeah, which is so nice so it's not super rough on the edges as well as in the nape um we've got a longer comb in the back Eh, get your face out of the shot. Eh, there, there we go. Um, Which is a problem for me because I don't like wearing a center part. And so when I go to shift the wig, like the one that you made me, mm -hmm. it, the, the comb is... Choo. <laughs> Cut the comb out. But there's nothing to hold that wig on. I need to order you a wig grip. Yeah, because I literally hair. have no hair on the sides where all the combs would be. I have no hair there. Well, you know what we can do? First, we can remix that song, I'm a bomb, A, B, to I'm a ball head, B, 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 you a ball head, B. And it also has like the little clip thingies in the back for added tension, you know, these things. Cap size, it looks pretty normal, but I will say it's got quite a bit of elastic in there, so it should fit all sorts of stuff. And once she gets it on, I'll let her tell you or not whether it's big hit for me. Jesus, take the wig. So, I like the way it feels. Um, I've Some of your other synthetic wigs, wigs are a lot more soft than this, though. I mean, it feels... I mean, oh, because soft. this is supposed to be like one of those natural texture ones. Oh, okay. Well, then that makes thing. sense, then. That makes so, sense. So, yeah, that's what it, it said. Incredibly natural look on there. So, it's supposed to have a little bit more of like that uh, natural looking texture. Okay. So, not so silky. So, yeah. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and see if we can... I don't know where the stocking caps are. I'm going to find a stocking cap. I need cap. something because we can't do that just throwing it on like that. can just put it on all willy-nilly. <laughs> <laughs> so we'll get that figured out. 
and then we'll pop this baby on and see what other modifications need to be made, if any, and then we'll get back and let you know the specs. <laughs> and keep in mind, if you want to see the makeup look that she comes up with for this, because she's going to do a makeup look for this wig on her channel, mm -hmm. we'll link that in the description box below. I'll also have it in the top right corner, and I'll put it in the comments, and I'll probably send it to you by Carrier Pigeon. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> All right, Glam Fam, so she's got the wig on. Yes. Oh, I can't do Wait, all that. It looks like, like my edges are <laughs> about to... Them edges is gone. Yeah, so like, I don't know if it's just with her hairline or what, but it's not giving full coverage here on the edge. Mm -hmm. But I don't mind the cut on her so much. Can you like, hold on, let me... I'm gonna get back here and that way I can kind of zoom on you a bit and make sure that they can kind of see all the details, so see here mmm this lovely view from the back and the sides is exactly what you need to get through your weekly routine now if you'll notice the wild gazelle as she flaunts her weave through the woods <laughs> now, I like the style it's similar to a haircut I used to have before I cut all my hair off so I mean the bob is cute I like the bob no, it's, it's not bad. I'm actually, like, at first I was like, I don't know, but now that I'm seeing it on camera a bit more, I'm like, hmm. But I still feel like it, maybe it needs a little bit of brushing, so hold on. I've got my Denman, the classic Denman. Of course. And I'm going to go ahead and brush through these curls so I'm going to see if we can kind of give it a little bit less of a wig. Oh, dang. That was your whole side. Yeah, I just scratched my just skin scratched off. the Halo Kitty out of her, but she deserved it. <laughs> She's got cats. She's probably used to it. I am used to that. If your wig is looking a little too wiggy and it's got a looser curl like this, taking a brush through it can give it a little bit more of a natural look because it's not those super perfect curls that are like, uh, like individualized. It just gives it more of a hair look. You have messy curls and you're okay with it. It's just a way of life. That's just how it is. That's just the way it is. Now, if you'll notice the gazelle in her wild habitat, now with the blue weave on, as she frolics through the woods, <laughs> <laughs> running Your from accent. cougars. <laughs> well, it's cute, though. I really do like it. It's cute. But you know, I gotta get used to wearing wigs. Yeah, she does. Okay, so this is your first wig experience. From one to ten, how many stars would you give this wig? 10 being good? Yes. Stars? <laughs> We're doing just stars? Ten, well, fine. Why does uh, it have to be so complicated? 10 out of 10 antelope. How <laughs> you got safari animals on your brain. He wants to go to Africa I was or watching Jumanji Oh, today. that's what it is. <laughs> <laughs> um, it's super comfortable. Um, it's stretchy. So because I don't have any of the clips done, mm -hmm. Um, because I just ain't got no hair to put, you know, clip them on. Um, it's nice and stretchy. It's comfortable. Um, Do you think that it would be big head friendly? Like, does it feel like there's more space? There feels there? like there's some space, and I also ha don't have my hair completely flat. So yeah, I feel like it's big head friendly, and it's nice and lightweight. Um, it feels good. So for me, pulling out a wig and just pulling out like you wanted, like just pulling it out mm -hmm. of the box, ready to go. I say probably like an eight, eight and a half. Okay. The cut's cute. The color's really cute. And I think for me, the most part is it's comfortable because I'm not used to having stuff on my head like that. So I don't know. To me, the only things I feel like could be a little better is uh, the front portion of the wig. Yeah, here. if it could be um, the if hair. If it either faced more forward or if it was just like an actual lace. But the nice thing is, if you're not one of those people who likes trimming lace, all that. This omits that step, so no need to trim lace. Mm -hmm. And um, the part line is is more for like brown skin tones, and even with those, like you can't see it real well. So I would put a little bit of like uh, powder or concealer in the part line. I honestly prefer powder. I feel like it looks a little bit more natural. Mm -hmm. um, some people prefer concealer because they want you to see it from across the street. So whatever floats your boat. White stripe, mm -hmm. yes, dark yes. stripe, landing planes. <laughs> you know. I feel like this would be. Um, manageable to wear during the summer. I don't know how women wear those long, long wigs or weave in the summertime here. Someone recently said like they didn't care for synthetic wigs and things like that on this channel. And I'll tell you guys, the benefit of synthetics over human hair is that you can sweat in it, you can get it wet, you can get rained on. If you're walking down the street and someone splashes a puddle on you, like you're still cute-ish. Okay. You know, cause, <laughs> <laughs> cause I mean, ultimately you're still sweaty or wet or covered in mud, but your hair is still Your hair is still looking cute. Mm -hmm. Curls will stay. Basically, the water will just drip off of it like those wigs. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I wonder if you can treat wigs with rain -X. I think we need to do a... We can do it like, like a science. Test yeah, like a science. Call Bill Nye. Oh, no one even likes Bill Nye anymore. He's like doing weird political stuff now, isn't he? 
I have no idea. what he's doing. Who knows? We'll call someone smart. <laughs> <laughs> Let us know what you guys think of this wig in the comment box down below. And of course, check out her video, which is up there in the top right corner and down there in the description box and further down there in the comment <laughs> box if you guys would like to see the makeup look that she comes up with for this. I'm just throwing suggestions. I'm throwing spaghetti Don't you worry, because when I saw it, this. I already had an idea in my brain, so. <laughs> she should get some unicorn highlighters and just throw horns all over her oh face. Oh my gosh, no thank you. Yeah, so I can break out again. She can be a unicorn mermaid. <laughs> uh, I'm so glad I'm that mermaid hair situation is done. I'm ready for this unicorn. <laughs> Mermaid, everything else, highlighter palette. Like, why are highlighters oh, coming gosh. in blue and purple and, and green, green and, and yellow? Like, why? It's, uh, I, don't I don't know. know. I'm all about natural skin anyway, so I'm a fuddy duddy. As I'm sitting over here with a full face of makeup. <laughs> Not natural skin, like you know, you guys know what I'm Not saying. natural, like skin but natural. That looks like skin. I just want it to look like skin. Like no one's skin is green unless you're on Guardians True. of the Galaxy, like and Infinity her skin War. Is really or green. Very, and I didn't see any highlights. So. No, it was very flat. Whoever she did her fighting. makeup needs some highlighting. She was fighting. She had no time to put on highlighter every day. And there's always time for highlighter. It's never time. <laughs> this is like the longest wig. You know what? Bobby, it's now a chit chat. So. <laughs> As I'm sitting over here sweating under this. First, it is really hot in this room. It's probably due to it's her breath. But no, literally, we have 15 million lights just set up bad. all over the yeah. room. There's only one, two, three, 25, four, five, six, seven. There's only eight lights. And they're hot. As they're you're sitting LED. here drinking your little drink. It's not refrigerated. And I'm sitting over here sweating. Yeah. It's cool though. It is cool. <laughs> it's room temp. <laughs> it's the temp of the other rooms. <laughs> not yeah, not this, this one. Room. For everyone who's been reading her comment section and being like super offended at how petty it has been. <laughs> so let me give you a breakdown. Okay. You know, just in case y'all, just in case y'all want to go check it out, <laughs> I'm not going to tell you which video, but somebody left a comment on my video. Basically, she was super upset about my eyebrows, was offended that nobody else was upset with my eyebrows like she was. And after, you know, talking crazy about how I need to fix my eyebrows and I need to do this and that, she was then, she then threw in the, oh, but I liked your video. Like that was supposed to help it out. So, of course, I sent Lynn a screenshot, and he was like, don't do it. Just say thank you and move on. And I was like, not today, Satan. Not today. Yeah, I was in a petty mood that day, and I was like, I would had enough. It had been a long day, and I guess was like, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and let her know. That Plus, she her tooth fell out. It yeah. was just a lie. <laughs> you know, I had a lot of stuff going on that day. So, he talking like my tooth just fell out my head. Let me, let me go ahead and make sure y'all know what's going on. So, I went to the dentist, got a crown. The crown keeps popping off, you know. That's what that is, you know. My because teacher, her dentist is really skilled. I don't know what's going on. It's a new dentist, so we'll see. <laughs> my tooth. Well, I've been carrying my tooth around all weekend, legit. Uh, the tooth issues that we have been having lately, like for people who are like, "Oh my gosh, YouTubers have money." YouTuber problems. Let me tell you, that's the reason why I'm drinking this out of a straw. <laughs> is because the temperature of it can avoid these teeth over here that I recently had to have worked on. I don't want a root canal, so I'm gonna just be drinking out of straws for the rest of my life. And that's why I have this little crown that I'm carrying around. My tooth fell out because I don't want to. <laughs> I don't want to get a root canal either. Yeah, they try, trying to hold on to this little two piece of tooth. <laughs> she's been using Polydent. Oh my it's God. A, it's a I, fixident or poly, fixident. poly grip? It's fixident. Uh -huh. I had to go to the grocery store for the first time in my life and buy fixident. <laughs> Denture cream? I cannot. When she told me that, I literally Everybody thinks lost it's hilarious. It. <laughs> my daughter was with me. She uh, was laughing. She was holding it up in the air for everybody to see. I was like, can we not? Like, I'm not, you know, people who use fixident or whatever, you know, denture cream. But I, you know, I ain't, I ain't got my, I got my teeth. You know, I shouldn't be having to do all that. Especially when I paid a dentist to do all that. I love so, how she tried to pretty that up. For those of you who have dentures, you know, don't I'm, be trying to act like you wanted them at her age. <laughs> <laughs> Auntie who? <laughs> so let's get back to this little petty story. Anywho, you know how we be tripping off. Petty. So yeah, so I went ahead and let her know about herself, and then that ensued like probably a, like a ten to fifteen you know comment situation going on between her and I. Yeah. I resisted the urge to jump in on it because I, I probably would have been petty and messy and been on the side of the of the negative Nancy and had her feeling like this. Oh bleepity bleep bleep. <laughs> 
but she's not one of my subbies. Like, you guys are amazing. Everybody who subs to me that's on Lynn's channel that's watching this video, I don't know where she just came off the street somewhere. She should have rolled off a, off a truck back somewhere. I have learned through YouTube, and let me tell you, if anyone here is planning on starting a YouTube channel, be so, so, so thankful for the trolls. They are amazing, and they, they don't do. even know it. They do, because they'll watch your video every time. They They're there every watch. time to watch yes. it. They comment, and then... Just to dislike and leave shady stuff. Mm -hmm. And then on top of that, they get arguments started, which boosts your engagement. They get people fighting. It mm -hmm. leads to, like, it leads to a little bit of, like, you know, insecurity. But... You know what? I think at my age and our age, it's, though... Yeah, it's like... What maybe 10 years ago, I'd have been like, oh, my God, my eyebrows need to be fixed because this <laughs> random girl told me... No. I mean, your eyebrows really did need to be fixed back then. They were terrible. Ten what? years ago, yes, I'm talking about now. No, no, I know. No, ago. I said maybe ten years ago as my self esteem ten years ago. Oh, not your not my, I know my eyebrows ten years ago. Years ago. Right I years. know they were, but you know what? They was in style back then. That's the only thing I can the say spermies, about that. Spermies yes. were in style back then? They were. Everybody had thin eyebrows. I'm telling you, I can't with this paper situation. This <laughs> I was waiting for you to do the noise again. <laughs> anyway, Lynn has been on my new videos. <laughs> I forgot how we got started yeah, on Yeah, I was like, wait a minute, what were we talking about? <laughs> Lynn has been on my videos fake trolling. So of course a lot of you guys know, you know, who he is and that we're like best friends or whatever, but there are several people who didn't really know and I was like, they come in the bath for me. <laughs> <laughs> they stick it up for me. Which part of me feels like I should feel some type of way. Like y'all supposed to jump on my side. You knew me first. This is like a relationship. They're like, on there like, me, excuse me, side. Lynn, you need to be calling her and telling her that or texting her. You tell her. her she's ugly in person, not online. <laughs> <laughs> this is not something you need to be telling her on her channel. Like they're, y'all been fighting for me That's so awesome. I appreciate that because <laughs> it's like they just gonna let him <laughs> harass me and talk crazy to me and, and gonna stop me but I think there's been one or two people that didn't know that like our <laughs> no, channels were related right, I'm sure they were like unsub yeah <laughs> I'm unsubbing Linwood right now because he legit like word for word was like posting like what she was <laughs> saying you know for different situations not just browse you know <laughs> but yeah all this foolishness with him and I usually happens between like 10 30 and like midnight oh my gosh it's always I later. Am I'm night. a night person. Mm -hmm. I'm up every day at five, but I am a night person. And the later it gets, the, the more petty, ridiculous, and foolish my responses get. So if you ever get a comment back from me that's like late at night, my time, I'm sorry. It's likely to, it's still, I'm thankful, but it's likely to have this tinge of pet, petalization. <laughs> not a tinge. Petty. Like he's doused in it. That's not even Linwood. <laughs> that's somebody else. It's just a slight, just a little splash. It's just like a, a little bit of flavor. No. A little bit of seasoning. Oh no, it's, it's not a little bit of flavor. If y'all search over. through some of my more recent videos, that's <laughs> all <laughs> the thing I'm going to tell you about. Just go search through the comments in some of my more recent videos and you'll see this tinge of pettiness. I don't know what she's talking about. Yeah. Don't mm -hmm. let her have you fooled. She is just as bad, except she uses potty words. And I <laughs> yeah, my salt and flavor comes with cuss words. <laughs> <laughs> That's my seasoning. Yes. Her salt <laughs> comes with a little extra cayenne. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and you know. some MSG and... Hey, but I didn't cuss her out when I was commenting back, so I was proud of you that. You did. You quoted her. I quoted her because she said cuss words, not me. <laughs> I when you put the quotation marks around it, that doesn't mean it's coming from me. So I, I'm free of that. That was something that she said. I'm sure that you said it with quotations, but you said it with more emphasis. Oh, I'm sure. If I could have, I should have like, capitalized it all. Thank you for your view, whoever you are. That's how I feel about everybody who trolls the comment section. You have anything negative to say, please post it. Totally fine with it. I'm okay, I'll live. Trust yeah, because you know I try to jump in there because ain't nobody talking about my best friend like that. <laughs> Only I can talk about I'm him like you. that. I'm always like, well, I appreciate you sharing He's your He's so opinion. nice. And I'm like, Lynn, <sighs> scream. Like, do something. Like, cuss him. Like, I'm you. Let me, like, let me do it. I'm like, let me do it. He's like, no, 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 no. I'm like, Phew. It's fine. I'll bless her with the love of the Lord. <laughs> <laughs> you guys have to keep in mind too though like I've been on YouTube for seven years I yeah. like oh my gosh the worst comment and most ridiculous yet somewhat hilarious uh, one I have gotten yet came on my Thai channel where somebody said that I was gay and that my videos were stupid my ties were for the F word you know the the gay F word and that, um, and that they were sleeping with my mom while she was on her period that was all 
all in one on comment. On one comment? One comment. They hit all the bases. Yes, every base there <laughs> oh was. God. And I couldn't even take them seriously because no. I was like, well, you nasty. <laughs> right? <laughs> I was just Funny. like, tell me about the creeper who called it to your job, talking about chewing on your toes. <laughs> so I have been working at my office for literally probably a month, if that. So, you know, <laughs> I'm like answering the phone. It's like, we're getting ready to close. I answer the phone. And this guy is like, are you wearing socks? <laughs> I can't even keep a straight face. I was like, what? <laughs> and he was like, what socks are you wearing? And I was like, I don't know, like ankle socks. I'm like, what is going on? I, I was confused. Yes, I was. I thought it was my husband because he was. He always liked to play, play, you know, play on the phone like that, or our other friend that you know plays. But I was like, this is not either of them. Like they can't change their voice that well. So then I was like what do you want? Like, what's going on? And he's like, I want to bite your toes and hear him crunch in my mouth. <laughs> and I was like, oh. And I was like, what did you just say? He's like, I want to bite your toes and feel him crunch in my mouth. And I was, <laughs> I was like, that sounds, you know, like you need to talk to somebody about that. And he was like, what socks are you wearing? Like, get so aggressive. And I ended up hanging up. I was like, okay, that's enough. I'm done. <laughs> I had somebody on Instagram ask me to send them a picture of my feet. I, it's the same guy. It's a fetish guy. He's a guy. It's a, yeah, he had a fetish. He yeah. Yeah. Like, um, he was like, he'll pay me for pictures of my feet. And I was like, mm, no, sir. No yeah, thanks. that's what the person said yeah. to me. Because I posted a picture where, like, it was on my men's fashion Instagram page. So many pages. <laughs> and I had ripped a hole in one of my socks. And my toenails were the size of talons. I was literally snatching salmon out of the lake with them. Mm. It was just like, yeah. Um, so, <laughs> I ripped through my sock. <laughs> yes. It's like the, the click, Jurassic click, click Park under the <laughs> I went ahead. I posted. I was like, oh, I'm so heartbroken. Funeral services for my sock will be this and that. Blah, blah, mm -hmm. blah. And, like. You know, someone was like, oh my gosh, blah, blah, And you know, I've learned, anytime people put too many LOLs in a message to me, something's not something's right. Something's going down. Mm -hmm. It's not just in the conversation at the second LOL. Mm -hmm. it's, it's not that funny. He got me so, on my wedding pictures, the, the shoes that I was posting for my wedding. Oh my God. That I was like, okay, nice. these are my wedding shoes. And then he hit me up and I was like, mm -mm, sir. I'm telling you, we will have to have a video that's just about stalkers. Yeah. Oh about. yeah. I've stalker. had some stalkers. The, the only thing this picture is missing is me. <laughs> He's had some stalkers that have like spilled over to me, which I don't appreciate because I'll be like, uh uh, you need to go ahead and back up off of that. That time you weren't even on YouTube, so it was really. No, no, I was on my personal Facebook page. <laughs> my personal page, too. So, yeah. Because back then, Lynn was adding any and everybody because he was just I like, I still do. Oh. I still do. Don't be tagging me in any of stuff. Not like anybody cares. Like I'm doing anything, like, you know, top <laughs> secret. I'm, I'm telling you, I have learned so well to be like, okay, we check in as we're leaving places. Mm -hmm. We tag places after we have left, not while we are there. I don't do live videos and locations where you can discern because there's it's, too many crazy. Yeah, out there's here. a lot. Of... I have been stalked on multiple occasions. Yeah, he he has. You know, you know all that sexiness. You know, <laughs> know it's, I'm currently it's all stalking these pets. him. Hold on. <laughs> I, can't I can't even stand. push it out. <laughs> it is a million degrees in this room. It is. I'm because sweating. Of so, we're going to have to call this chit chat. <laughs> <laughs> we're going to have to call this chit chat uh, quits. Is that what you call it? You quits. Call it quits? Yeah. We need to do another video where we just sit. And we have so much information. Like, so much. Push. It's not useful information. Not useful. I didn't say useful. <laughs> it won't bless your life. No. But, uh, you know. But yeah. Really <laughs> <laughs> so, I'm just like things in my head, like. <laughs> and as you can see this is how we always are it's from one story to the next to the next back to the original story and Which, back to if another you one haven't seen our get ready with us video that's full of all sorts of foolishness yeah it's on my channel I'll link that as well make sure you check that out uh so just go over to her channel check out the makeup look for Come this over video. see check my you know check my page out yeah. my channel out you know you want to sit with us you're not wearing make sure you wear today. pink though <laughs> <laughs> Until <laughs> <laughs> next time, you guys. Take care. God bless. Stay glam. You know we love you, boo. Leave all your comments down below. If you're not subscribed, subscribe. Turn on the bell notifications because you want to know what we doing, when we doing, how we doing, why we doing, where right we doing. Right at the doing. second that we do it. Yes, all of that. <laughs> Bye. Bye, you guys. Love you. <laughs>